Hey everybody, it's Martin with Android News and All the Byte, and this is going to be how you're going to be able to load some of the amazing apps that you currently have on the Google Play Store without the Google Play Store on the Huawei P40 Pro. You're going to be able to find all the information I'm going to be talking about in the description below, as well as all the links to the application and the websites. If you've liked the video, give me a thumbs up, and if you didn't like the video, tell me why in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell to see the next video I'm going to be posting. Check it out. Today I'm going to show you how you can get some of the most popular apps installed on your Huawei P40 Pro. It's going to be require a bit of know-how, but I'll do my best to make sure everything is crystal clear. I must mention that you should not stray off path, don't go installing anything and everything you find on the internet, or you'll get into a whole world of trouble. I'm going to be covering a few apps that you'll be able to install on your Huawei P40 Pro. Some of the most popular ones that you can usually find on Android. Uh, we're going to cover Facebook, Facebook Messenger, we're going to cover Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Spotify, Netflix, WhatsApp, Waze. Uh, we're going to go to Candy Crush, Temple Run, and Fortnite. One of the most popular uh, first person shooter and it's an MMO. Holy smoke, so let's get Facebook loaded, okay? So the process will be mostly the same for the majority of those apps. You're going to open up the Huawei browser at the bottom right and in the address bar you're going to type in uh, apkmirror.com. On the APK Mirror website you're going to search and click on the magnifying glass at the top and enter uh, the word Facebook. On the list what's going to happen is you're going to get a list of uh, application and you're going to scroll down until you see Facebook uh, but make sure you don't see beta or alpha. Uh, one of the latest version with the latest date on it. So keep scrolling until you find it. It's usually going to be on the second page. And once you do find it, you can click on the download arrow at the at the, at the end of that uh, of Facebook, and then it will bring you up to some of the download information. Uh, if you scroll down the page, uh, you'll be able to get to uh, a section that has a uh, version number, and you can just click on the variant with the version number. It will bring you to the actual download page for that application. Once the application is loaded on your screen, you will then get a, uh, a download APK button. Click it and click the download link at the bottom. The file will download. You're going to need to accept several prompts and allow them. So go on with that and accept them and click install. Once the application is installed on your device, it could take about 10 to 20 seconds. You'll then be able to click on the open button that you're going to see at the bottom and or done. Uh, click open, then put in your uh, device, not your device information, but your email and your password for Facebook, and you'll be logged into the application. All right, let's open up the browser from the bottom right, and let's this time we're going to search for the Amazon App Store. So type in that and click on the Amazon App Store that you'll see in the list. Download the Amazon App Store program on your phone and click open at the bottom. Once the app store is downloaded, do the same thing as you did before, click the download and install button. Once it's installed on your smartphone, you'll be able to click open. Once you've clicked open, what you'll be able to do is install Spotify. So in the list on the application itself, you're going to type in Spotify and then you're going to click download on Spotify. Let's get some Fortnite magic going. So let's uh, open up the browser from the uh, bottom right there. Once we've opened the browser, we're going to point ourselves to uh, the address fortnite.com forward slash Android. Once the page is loaded, it's going to be really easy. We're going to click on the button that says Epic Game App. It's going to download the program. You're going to click the download button. You're going to continue with the download. Once it's downloaded, you're going to click install. Once the installation is completed, you're going to open up the application. You're going to see Fortnite and then you're going to click on Fortnite. And then you're going to click on the install button. It's going to download an installer to your smartphone. Wait for that to complete. Once it's completed, proceed with all the prompts and allow them. Click the install button and wait for it to complete. 
click open on the application, accept the permissions. It will give you some indication that uh, you're running an older version, which is fine. Then once the application starts, you're going to want to click on the uh, OK button to accept the uh, terms. Then you're going to log in into your account for Epic Game. And once you are logged in, you will click on the install button, which uh, is about a 8 gig download. Getting Netflix loaded onto your smartphone is going to be easy. Point yourself to apkmirror.com. And on APK Mirror, we're going to actually install the APK Mirror installer. So search for that. It's going to be the first download you're going to see. So you're going to download that and click on the little arrow. Grab the first installer. It's version 1.2.2. And scroll to the bottom and uh, click download the APK. Once the APK is installed on your device, we will then go back to uh, APK Mirror. So we're going to browse back to apkmirror.com on the browser and search for Netflix. Netflix is a bundle, so we'll need to select the right one. So it doesn't matter which version you want to grab. I grabbed the first one and I went down the list to look at the variants. And I grabbed the first one I saw on the list that matches uh, for everything I need. And I clicked the download APK bundle. I downloaded that. I accepted the, uh, the conditions. And then what I did, once the download was finished, is I went back on the device and I opened up the application called APK Mirror Installer. And once I've got that running, I browsed to the download folder on my phone and I grabbed the Netflix bundle. I clicked it and then I click install package. And then on the install package, I'm going to get some options. Just accept the default and install them. It's going to prompt you to allow the installation. And so you're going to toggle that and allow the installation. Then you have about a 30 second window for an ad in the program. So just wait for the ad to run out. Once the ad does run out, it'll take about 30 seconds. Uh, you'll get to the end and you'll be able to click the X at the top left. All right, so once you've clicked on the X, the program will begin to install the package. Click the install button again. So click the install this button. Complete the installation. Click close. Exit the program and swipe it up. And then you have Netflix installed. If you click on Netflix, it's going to load up. So what you'll do next is once Netflix is uh, opened up on your phone, you're going to get some information, just accept it. And then what you're going to do is you're going to log in into your account. So these are three methods you can use to install some of the applications on the Huawei P40 Pro. Uh, these, uh, these methods are made for you to install all the applications you need. The issue comes to finding the applications at the right place to actually be able to use them properly. Uh, APK Mirror is a great source for that. And there are three methods you can use like I've shown you. One is the installation via the APK. The other one is the installation via the APK Mirror installer because it installs bundle. And then you have the third option which is installing the application via the manufacturer's website such as Epic Games which allows you to install Fortnite. If there's anything else, leave me a comment below. Like the video, subscribe to the notification bell, this way you'll get the next video. Have a good night.